The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Andrew Rogers here on the Eagles Sports Network with Food City Player of the Game, Mitchell Heinkup. He scores twice in Kirsten Newman's season opening draw with Trevec and Nazarene here on the Eagles Sports Network. Uh, Mitch, great start to the year. Probably can't ask for a better one. A good corner kick. Uh, you end up in the right place at the right time. A couple of deflections leads to your first goal, and then you take advantage of a spot opportunity there with the penalty kick goal. Uh, how gratifying was that for you? You scored only twice last year. Uh, how gratifying was it to get on the board twice uh, so early in this one? Yeah, of course, it's a good feeling, uh, especially what you said. I scored twice last year in a whole season. Uh, and to score twice now in one game, and I think it was 25 minutes, yeah, that's, of course, personally for me, uh, really good. But still, I prefer to uh, that I didn't score and win than this, but it Cer is what it is. Certainly, it seemed like the offense was clicking early on. What did you like about the development? Uh, I know the penalty kick goal was because of a foul in the box, but there's a lead-up to that that obviously yeah. led to a good scoring opportunity for that foul. So what did you like about the first 25 uh, offensively? Uh, I think the rotations and the runs in behind were very good. Um, with Antoine and Duxie up top, we have two very different strikers. Yep. Um, but also they know when to drop in and when to run in behind, uh, which makes it easier for everyone to, uh, yeah, to build up and create the opportunities. Uh, and that's uh, the build up to the penalty kick. Um, I think it started at the back, ball in behind, and Antoine, he got the foul. And that's how he scored it 2-0. Certainly, uh, they're able to get on the board there. With about 10 minutes or so left in the first half off a turnover. It wasn't really even an opportunity they created. It was almost it was a self-inflicted wound there uh, defensively. How did that shape the confidence of the team the rest of the way? It seemed like Trevecca knew you guys uh, had taken that hit right there and were able to run uh, the rest of the way that led to the late goal, too. Uh, yeah, I think a couple minutes before that, we had all, already a couple breakdowns. Um, so I think they solid opportunities pressed us high yep. and what we did was uh, we kept making the same mistakes over and over again uh, it touched our confidence why at some point we did not play out of back of out of the back anymore um, and try to play the long ball but that's not our uh, our best play um, and yeah as I said they knew we had some breakdowns and they kept pressing and then it was a personal um, break that one leader to the 2 1. Certainly, it's a tie uh, when you look at the record, but it feels like a loss. So, how do you bounce back? You get two full days off before you travel to Young Harris uh, on Sunday evening, the first of three road games as well before you're back at home. What's the key in the next couple of days uh, to realize, okay, it was still a tie, but we've got things to work on? What's it take to get ready for Sunday? Of course, we uh, have to uh, reflect on this game, uh, use the video. Um, also, we have to stay together as a team. Um, what I said to coach and what coach said as well, it's still a long season. Um, we didn't lose, what's a good thing, but still uh, we felt we could do a lot better. Um, now two days off, time to recover, reflect, and then go again on Sunday because that's our next opportunity to, uh, to take away the win. Thanks for the time as always, and congratulations on scoring twice. Thank you. That is Food City Player of the Game, Mitchell Honkup. Stay in the picture. Oh, stay in the picture. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> That's Food City Player of the Game, Mitchell Honkup. I'm Andrew Rogers, and this is the Eagles Sports Network.